for whatever reason, this is shot number four at me making this video, y'all. Like, I can't, I can't today. I'm stumbling over all of my words, and I said the last time, if I stumble, forget it. I'm still keeping the video. But then it was like such a blunder. <laughs> then I'm starting over for time number four. Here we go. Number two, new arrival this week, the Karis Snap Pullover. She will bring you, I hope, like she's been bringing me in the office as she's hung on our little rack, spring joy. Um, does anybody else have kids who've come home from school and they're like, mommy, the groundhog, whatever he's supposed to do, um, said that spring was coming and you're like, but it ain't here. Anyways, like we had snow in Nashville this week. Or when was that? Friday. Anyways, the Kara Snap pullover. She's beckoning spring to come with her little springy, flowery, summery, sunsetty goodness. And I'm loving her. And I really, let's talk about her. Let's talk about how you'll wear her this spring and likely into the summer. At least I think that I will. So this is like, a, they call it ginger. And yet again, I just don't, if y'all have an example of this being the color ginger, like in nature, will you send it to me? Because to me, this is like, this is a pinky salmon. What ginger? I'm thinking of ginger root and this is not. But anyways, um, okay. So this really, really soft look at her. She's soft pinky salmon color. It's cotton polyester blend, primarily cotton, a little bit of polyester. So it does have some stretch to it. It's not a stiff pullover that's like, doesn't it, you can see it has some give to it, but it's also not like crazy overly stretchy. So, but I don't think you're going to care because it's like this nice oversized loose thing. So on the outside, it gives you these sweatshirt vibes, but we're calling it a pullover for a couple of reasons. Number one, because it is, but also because it's not your typical, the typical weight of a sweatshirt, even though it has that kind of look, it's really lightweight, which is why we wanted to launch it this spring. You can tell kind of on the inside that it has you can see how thin it is. Like, do you see, you can see my thumb. So it's not like, and you can see like the shape of it really well. So it's not a super thick material, but it's really, really soft and just kind of has a little bit of a washed look. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Let's talk about the details. The Karis has this little wide ribbed collar. It matches these cuffs that I already started to roll up as well as the hemline. On this collar too are these five snap buttons. So I left all five there. This is what they look like on the other side. Can you see? Um, just a little silver ring. I left, just to show you kind of like a real summer feel, um, spring feel, I left all five undone. You could also snap, like I snapped that. You can snap it however high you want. But you can also, I just wanted to show you that as the weather warms, you can wear this unsnapped a little bit more. And it's still, in my opinion, modest. Like I'm not about to show the world anything. So it has these cute dropped shoulders. And then I have, you can see how it's kind of an oversized fit ish. Um, but, it, and these sleeves are super relaxed and cozy. I have it front tucked, which you can totally do because it is a light, well, I have front tuck everything, but it is a light enough weight sweatshirt that you can front tuck it. But it also kind of cinches around your waistline. You'll be able to see pictures of it styled both ways on the website. It kind of cinches around your waist time, waistline to give you a little bit of shape where you don't, if the front tuck is not your thing, you can totally wear this and not look frumpy at all. So, um, what else was I gonna say to you? Oh, the sizing, super important. I am wearing a size small medium. So it's going to come in small, medium, medium, large. This is me as a small D cup and I have plenty of room. A, a medium could definitely wear this thing. And then of course, medium large. I'm hoping that you're gonna see, I'm still not positive, but I'm hoping that you're gonna be able to see Meredith maybe in both sizes. We'll see. Let's fingers crossed that you will. 
Um, but also comes in a medium large. So I am 5'5", five, five, and it's hitting like, whoop, lost my balance. It's hitting at the top of my jeans. So these are our Dakota Girlfriend jeans. They are a lower mid-rise jean, and I have, they're stopping like here, and this is still going plenty long, so no need for high-rise jeans if those aren't your thing. But also these lower jeans, like this is my belly button, if that gives you an idea of how long this thing. So plenty long plenty long y'all y'all this is going to be easy to toss over a t-shirt with your leggings run to the gym in this thing wear it outside in the cool spring summer evenings put it on with some jeans and look put together these are our leather shoes that are coming here soon you could have it on with some tennis shoes some flip-flops whatever and on Thursday I'll show it to you with some little blue jean shorts just to show you how you can really wear it into the summertime so the Karis y'all she's cute she's casual she's happy you know I am not a girl who is drawn towards a ton of color in my wardrobe but I really like this piece and I think that sometimes a little splash of fun it feels like youthful and just on a dreary day like today I'm feeling it, y'all. Okay, the Karis. She's dropping Thursday morning at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time. You will definitely see Becca in the medium-large tomorrow, and hopefully you'll see Meredith, too.